What up, my dudes? It's Max from Papillon Effect, and I think it's about time for another beer plays. Roll the theme music! Take a sip. Mmm. Oh, shit. Delicious. Man, it's been... It's been fucking forever since I've done one of these. Not that anyone... Anyone watches this anyway, but... Let's see. Oh, Masakisa. Masakisa? Or something? It's about... Hold on, what is this? This game includes mature content from... Okay, violence and... Oppressive themes? Recommended for ages 18 plus. Click no to immediately exit this program. Click yes to proceed. Uh, yes. So, it's about, like, a kid that, um... He sees the future that he becomes a psychopath or something? Based on a true story. Now, it's supposed to be a point-and-click. Hello, Hamilton. Did you run away again? Who's there? Yes, you know how father can be. Oh, he got beaten. Um, who's there? Do you not know? Please, no more talking, please. I don't need you? Oh, he's got a voice in his head. Please, no more... T uh... Kind of gives it away. Do you think you can silence me, Hamilton? Or our voice is too strong. Well, age key. Flex of rust and earth stain its bow and blade. <clears throat> Eye opens inventory. E to continue. Why does it have the button prompts? Anyways, I, I chose this one because I'm at least able to use. I don't like my, my keyboard super clicky. So. Oh, I guess you can move with the... if you wanted to play it that way. But yeah, you can... I think I've mentioned it before, it's like loud as fuck. So, I typically play with the controller, or this one, it's a point and click. Uh, oh, I can just put the... Put the key in it. Alright, well... Let's see here. <laughs> oh wait, actually, you know what? No, can I? I guess I'm gonna have to hit keys at some point. Oh, maybe not. The key didn't have... Can I not just put the key? Alright. Well, we've already gotten the snag. Um. Oh, actually, let me just try the key on the door. Maybe that works. It doesn't look like there's a lock on it. Um, it's not. Hold on. What the fuck? I have the key selected, and it's not, it's not opting. Well, shit, man, that's <laughs> my first fucking, the first fucking screen, I'm like, ah, what the fuck do I do? Um, alright, you gotta be smarter, I, dude, this is the first beer I'm having, so I'm like, I'm not even stupid yet. The series is gonna turn into a dark side fail, I can feel it. Was it? I guess I could just fuck with it. Nope. Oh, it resets. Oh, maybe there's like a hint, like if I scroll through it, do the numbers look? I swear to God, it's like if that worked, I would have to reset everything, because <laughs> it's like, it's like, oh, I just guessed it, but no one would believe that I didn't. I just fucking guessed it. Um, is there? Do I have other buttons to hit? 
This is probably super annoying. I'm sorry, I apologize. Controls. Uh, interact is E. Yeah, but I can just click. Fire one, mass zero. Pills or T? Rescue R. Dialogue option. Uh, I think I'm gonna have to hit some uh, some key presses at some point. <clears throat> All right. Um, go back. So T takes pills. I swear I just saw something up here. Oh God damn it, motherfuckers! Do I... do I drag it? Oh. Oh. Oh, you shit, motherfucker. Ah! <laughs> Holy shit. I didn't know I was gonna have fucking jump scares. Oh shit, I just... Okay, act one, the family, and then... Like, I got headphones in. God damn it. I think I picked the wrong fucking game. I thought I was- I, thought, I mean, I thought it was gonna be creepy and all that shit. Have a happy time drinking a beer. Fuck you. Welcome back. What was that? I don't feel very- Uh, what was that? They call him... The Gray Man? I'm like an asshole to me. I don't like him. Yeah, I don't like him. He scared the shit out of me. I don't think he cares if you like him or not. Well, you got a point there. Either way, I'm sure that we will see him again soon. Oh, Christ almighty. Dude, that fucking scared me, man. I got a I got a 55-inch TV that I use as my computer monitor. That fucking scared the shit out of me. Your poor mother, she must be worried sick about you. Okay. Oh, am I like, can I leave then? Cause he just scared my ass back in here. Did, or did he like throw me in here? My mother's worried. I have a feeling this dude's gonna pop up a lot and fucking jump scare me. That's gonna annoy the shit. Oh, I, okay. All right, it's one of those, one of those point and clicks where it's from your perspective, but it's always like, ooh, what's this? Move deeper into the valley. Okay. So he didn't kill me though, he just scared the shit out of me. Head back towards home. I said my mom was worried about me, so I guess we'll go back. <clears throat> or whatever. Back towards the shed. Uh, it's fucking bullshit, dude. Towards the crick. I hate jump scares. That, that shit pisses me off, man. This house looks like dog shit. Alright. Oh. Well, they've got interesting architecture. Everyone's fucking ghost and shit. Jesus Christ. Yeah, I don't think to the parlor. I don't think I'm gonna enjoy this game. So this, this is a lot creepier. I, I guess you'll enjoy it. What the fuck, dude? <laughs> what the fuck? I don't want to play this. I want to play this fucking game. Can I go under upstairs and then? God damn. All right, whatever. Oh my god. I'm so fucking loud. Hold on. Turns that down a little bit on my. Um. At least, at least I got volume controls. Oh, uh, I don't have to minimize. Um. Owl, owl lady face. Jeez, these are so unsettling. On oh, the dudes like hung. Man, whoever made this game was really good at it. Like he's a fucking asshole. I'm gonna get, I'm gonna get fucking jump scared. I'm gonna get fucking jump scared. God damn it. 
My dear sweet mother, she loves you. She loves you not. What? Alright, to the far. I just came from there. Something's gonna roll on the screen. It's got fucking. I hope there's no death scenario. I mean, not necessarily death scenarios, but like. Oh, yeah, she scared me. A little bit. Um, what's that called? Where I gotta like reset. You know what I mean? I hope it's just a story. <coughs> Excuse me. Hamilton, my dear child, how I've missed you. Yeah. Where have you been? How dare you frighten me like this? Uh, I'm sorry, mother. I've been here in the house all day. I was just outside, not far from here. Do you think I'm a fool? You forget that I created you. Worthless creation that you are. This reminds me of something. You know, if I discovered you're lying, <laughs> I will have your father beat your skull to the floorboards. Wow, what a great family. Now tell me again, where were you? Sorry, I went to the old shed in the valley. Where were you hiding? Tell him the truth. You spy this little shit lying to your own mother? Your father will beat you till your tears run dry. And when your father... God, and it zooms in on her. Father is done with you. I won't come to help you this time. You can cry all you want. Your father will... Wait, your father... Ah, Hamilton, I am reminded. My dear child, I have a task for you. Please don't make me see... Oh, what is the task? My sweet child, you are a good boy. How uh, you've grown. I love you, Hamilton. You do know that I love you, don't you? Oh, she's even, like, crazy. I need you to bring your father his medication. The father hates me. But I don't want to see father. Um... I don't know, it's kind of the same thing, whatever. Your father loves you, Hamilton, almost as much as I do. He is upstairs in his room. Be a good lad now. Take him his medication. You will do with that, won't you? Fine, I will do it. I don't want to. I mean, I guess I gotta progress the story. Whatever, fine, I'll do it. Dear sweet Hamilton. This, uh, medication. The scent surges through your nose, your eyes water. Okay. I'm gone. I'm gonna move my keyboard back a bit, <clears throat> just in case I get frightened and scare my beer all over myself. Yeah. Did that? Okay, I thought that changed. I have a grandfather clock in my house. It doesn't work. Or in my apartment, I should say. It does not work. Um, they gave me free reign to go around, but that that idiot asshole's outside, so I didn't want to want to. I want to. I just wanted to go to the... Mom sounded... It sounded like, oh, the mom's worried, so... Who fucking puts these everywhere? Oh, is this my room? Walt... No, Walt... Oh, that's the dad's room? Uh, that's like the only normal photo. <clears throat> um... Like, I guess I could explore, but I don't want to explore. Who disturbs me? F father? Spit it out, boy! You have my medicine. Yes. Bring it into me. Alright. That's like a slendy man looking face. No doorknob. It's like a hidden hidden entrance. Oh, he's right there. Okay. I'm gonna look this way a little bit. I bet you because if I look the other way, he's gonna smack me. Oh no. Okay, I, I, I just got it. His dad looks a little old. God, could you imagine? Like, where do you even find these kind of paintings, man? Oh, I just got a medication. Damn. Oh, no, I drag it. That's what you do. You drag. <coughs> is that it? What is it, boy? Father, I... Spit it out! Why must you stammer and stutter like a frightened girl? Oh, this does remind me of... Anyways. Uh, I'm sorry. I'm sorry? Why are you always sorry? You sorry son of a bitch, do you know how it's really? Who's really sorry? It is I that is sorry. You're sorry, father. I'm glad to hear- Uh Yes, boy. I'm sorry that I ever let that bitch of a mother birth you into existence. <laughs> Jesus fucking Christ, dude! What is this? 
<laughs> what did I pop in? I had this. It cost two bucks. Like I bought it like three fucking years ago on Steam and never played it. I was like, oh, that'd make a good let's play. It looks, it looks interesting. Okay. Do you know if she's only ever give birth to one truly good child? Then God looked down from heaven and he determined that I deserved less. He took my own son away from me. And then he cursed your mother's mind, turned her heart against itself. And then I beat her, <laughs> you see? <laughs> what the fuck? I tried to fix what he did to me, but it was futile. I told her I needed more. We must replenish what God stole from me. And she gave me Walter. The masochistic, the masochistic filth. You don't understand the pain is good. What? Father, he is your son. Oh, am I the good son? Is that what I'm the good one, and the other one's all fucked up? Father, he is your son. Son, he is no more my seed than you. Oh, okay. So I'm the third child then, I guess. He is a curse from God, like you. At first I tried to beat the evil out of him, but then... Wow! Wow! I found he just thrived on the pain I inflicted. But then, the cruelest of jokes, God gave me... Yay, okay, I'm the third, third child. Mm. You're the worst combination of all their evils. But I can't help. What is wrong with him? I should have never let her birth you. I stood there with the hanger and the knife. Oh my god! I was ready to carve you from her womb. But your mother screamed. She promised me that you'd be different. But you tricked her. You lied to her. Do you know why God gave you to me? I'm gonna get jump scared. I know it. It's gonna fucking piss me off. You know what? Why God gave you to me? Uh... No. Of course you don't. No. God gave me you so that I could beat the evil from you. And with his help, I will surely be victorious. Okay. I thought I was gonna get jump scared. I can't say I enjoy the kid getting beat either, but like... At least I wasn't jump scared. scare him he fears us Hamilton because he doesn't understand us you know in the beginning it's based on a true story I really hope this is not this does not seem based on a true story or what we will become and what we, we will become is what truly frightens him how your heart races can you feel it in your chest you must calm yourself there are some pills in your pocket take the pills why do I need pills I don't need any why do I need them you're a special boy Hamilton so special, in fact, there are those out there who would seek to take you and make you their own. Do you remember outside the shed in the woods, the gray man? There are others far worse than me. Now take your pills. All right, T, take the pills. Okay, I'm gonna just, I'm just back now. That's the only normal photo. I'm guessing that must be what the first sum looked like. Maybe. I don't know. I don't know why I'm in here. I'm gonna get jump scared. Oh, he, he drew on the wall, or he... I'm gonna get jump scared. I'm gonna get jump scared. I know it. I know it. Why did you come in here? To this, like, asylum room. Why did you come in here? Max, why would you do that? Oh, yep, there he is. That's, uh, he's covered in blood and shit. Hello, brother. Silence. What happened to your face? So much blood in here. Did father do this to you? 
Why does mother let this happen to you? Girl, you are bleeding. Wipe the blood from his face. All right, I'm gonna I'm gonna take my headphones off. <laughs> okay, and I'm gonna click. All right, I put the headphones back on. Jeez, I just gotta take it. I just gotta take it. Sorry, I've done this to you. What did you do? Cause of... he's not saying anything. Oh, now I removed your mask. Fine, I will leave you be. Oh, come on, bro. You're gonna make. I I, I kind of want to do it though. If I just let him loose, I don't. I don't. Roll the theme music. I don't exactly have a reason. I'm gonna leave him be. It's like, why would I take his mask off? I don't exactly have a reason to do anything here. So my dad's in there and he's an asshole. I have no objective. I guess I just explore. That boy in the backyard, can you hear him? He is calling your name. Mm. Front yard. Oh, you got me on that one a little bit. Thought that was something else. Oh, hey, it's this motherfucker. Uh, scratched a bunch of shit into the wall. Or under the tree. You know that's my tree, right? <clears throat> Are you Hamilton? His eyes aren't black, so maybe he's a good guy? Yes, how do you know my name? My friends told me that I would find you here. Okay? They told me that I would find a boy here with blood on his face. Oh. Hmm. You do seem to meet that description. That's how often he gets beat. He's like, oh, dude, if you go down to Hamilton's place, you'll know, you'll know who Hamilton is. He's a kid with the blood on his face. Like, like how, how, how do you know? It's like, he just gets beat all the time, man. I suppose I should introduce myself. My name is Albert. Uh, what friends are you talking about? How do they know I would be here? What friends are you... The angel, Michael, that's his name. Oh, uh, okay. He knows everything. This sounds crazy, but he can even see into the future. Wonderful. This is just becoming a greater and greater story. The future <clears throat> sounds wonderful. Uh, that does sound crazy. I don't believe in angels. Um, whatever. I'm a kid. I guess I'd say something like that. I promise you, he really is wonderful. The messenger. That's what his name means. Michael? Is that what it means? It's a beautiful name, isn't it? It really is beautiful. I like my name better. Hamilton. I don't like the name Hamilton. And it's not just Michael. There is a girl with him. Her name is Grace. She is. Well, it's hard to describe. Oh, man, this is like that really scary part of Christianity. You know what I mean? When people go crazy and think the devil and all this shit. She is perfect. Can't you see the future, too? Perfect. No one can be perfect. Can't you see the future, too? No, she is far more powerful than... Far more powerful. What do you mean? She is the end of our story. Okay. Hmm. The end of our story? I don't understand. How do I meet these friends of yours? No, I guess to, by dying. Okay, I don't understand. I don't see how you could understand. You never met them. How do I meet these friends of yours? You will find them at the shrine, deep in the woods. There will be a guardian outside the gate. You will need to tell him the magic words, then he will let you in. But if you get them wrong, he will kill you. So be sure to get them right. How I know these magic words? I promise you, you will know them. But how do I find the shrine? Go deep into the woods. When you find the guardian, he will take you into the shrine. My friends will be waiting for you. Okay, it's a broad and heavy blade, relies on your arm's momentum, separates targets. <laughs> what? <clears throat> I mean, I know what it, it's saying. I'm assuming that I'm going to use it to attack 
innocence, what have you. <clears throat> Can I use it on this? No. What the fuck is going on? Where am I? Oh shit! Oh fuck! Oh, I'm in the I'm in the psychologist psychiatrist's office, aren't I? There you are. Oh, I lost you for a moment. <clears throat> Where am I? Oh, I've got TV vision. Shall we continue? Uh, yes, continue. Good. So tell me, Albert. Would you say that you're close to your mother? Wait, so am I... I don't understand. So this is probably me in the future, looking back on... Close, that's an odd word for it. Albert, my name's Hamilton. <laughs> Alright. Well, uh... Albert, my name's Hamilton. Very well. You use whatever name that makes you feel comfortable. Is that fair? I suppose. Good. Albert, didn't... Who, saw... Who said that they were Albert before? I forgot the father said something like that. Is it like the first son was named Albert? So would you say that your mother and you were close? Close, that's an odd word for it. Is it? How would you describe it? She was abused a shell. Hmm. I kind of both. I had no feelings or love for her. Um Indeed. You told me your father also beat her as well. How did that make you feel? Jealous? What is with this fucking... Oh my god, what am I playing? I don't know, mixed feelings? It made me feel sad for her. Um, I guess mixed feelings, because she, 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 she put him up to it sometimes. <clears throat> Confused feelings are common. I understand. These are not pleasant topics to discuss. Not particularly. I don't mind. I like when it's unpleasant. That's so fucked up. I do not doubt you. But. <clears throat> let's shift topics for a moment. Let's talk about your father. If we must. Use one word to describe your father. Sadist. Drunkard. Visionary. Oh my god. Uh, I'm going to go with say it, drunkard. Because he thought, he was one of those guys that, like, he's religious or whatever, he, he thought he was doing the right thing. How does that make you feel? My head, I don't feel. You alright? Albert? Albert? I think we're losing him. Act 2. The friends. Jesus, what is this game? Am I supposed to take these pills frequently? Oh, I see, so I... Wait. Yo. I kinda got a fucked up, uh... Is she gonna be in here still? No, okay, it wouldn't let me. I don't know, should I talk to her? Hamilton, sweet child, have you been to see your dear father? Yes. Mother, he beat me. Oh, you are a good boy, such a sweet... What's this? Why is there blood on your clothes? How many times have I told you not to get blood on your... Jesus, fuck! Stupid, stupid boy. Just you wait till your father finds out about this. Alright. Okay. I was thinking like maybe I'll go take the mask off. But I kinda don't want to. I don't, I don't wanna go there. I'm done. So I'm going to the woods now. Probably gonna see that fucking dude jump scare me again. 
You know, I, I the thing is, is like I, I I put the headphones on because then it allows me to hear the game better while I'm talking. Okay, like it's it's, be it's better. Um, oh, so we go to the woods to find an angel. The angel guides us. <laughs> Would you have rather I stayed home? Yeah, that's basically that was my idea of it. It's better than nothing. For more beatings, uh, we may actually enjoy that. Really? But, are we sure that we can trust Albert? Oh, yeah, Albert was that kid, okay, so. I forgot his name for some reason. I feel a connection to him, I think we can. I'm not even sure I can trust you, duh. <clears throat> oh, Hamilton, can you not even trust yourself? No? As it was towards the creek. I said go to the woods. So what's at the crick? And yes, I pronounced it crick, not creek. Someone's gonna point that out. What is this? The sound of rain? Uh, this doesn't seem like the woods. Um, shit, I feel like I'm going the wrong way. Oh. Wonderful. This kid looks... something. Anything else over here? Enter the woods. Oh, hey, okay, the woods is where I needed to go. So I'm, I'm, I'm finding it. I don't think he's the guardian. <coughs> hello, who are you? Uh, hello? Um, hello. Mm. Uh, what's your name? I don't think I should be talking to you. Probably not. Why can't you talk to me? Please leave me be. You frighten me. Let's be friends. Leave me alone, please. Okay, <laughs> oh, Leave me alone, please. Fine, whatever. Fuck you, too. I'm guessing that Hamilton, or Albert, or whatever, he, 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 he must be deformed. Dark things wait in the rain. I don't think you're prepared yet. Okay, well, I said go to the woods. <clears throat> and if the game's gonna, like, say, like, don't go that way because, like, whatever, it's just not gonna let me, then I'll, I'll just follow the path. I guess it's just a story. This doesn't really feel like a whole lot of point and clicky. The only thing that was hard to figure out, or the thing I didn't know how to figure out, was using the fucking item. Dragging that shit. Cemetery. Is there more this way? A path. The cemetery or the path? They said I need to go to a shrine, which I would assume a shrine would be in the cemetery, so let's go this way. I don't, uh... A path. Okay. The valley. The woods. Oh, okay, so that takes me out of it. This goes back to the woods. I don't know. Maybe I shouldn't fuck around too much. Yeah, I think the val that'll lead me back to the shed, I'm thinking. Because, like, there was a thing that said the valley before, and I was, that was originally where I was going to go, but then I saw the windmill, and I thought that looked less scary. The statues, they watch us, as if they know the way. Okay. Well, wait. So is it trying to give me a hint on which way to go? Because there's one by each path. Mm. Oh, that's a Cthulhu looking motherfucker right there. The shrine. Oh, hey, the shrine! This is where we're supposed to go. I'm gonna get beat again. <laughs> What the fuck is this? <laughs> a man bear. 
Antelope bear. Alright. Greetings, child. What up, dude? <laughs> I expected something scary. Uh, who are you? I have many names. Douchebag. Motherfucker. And son of a bitch. More numerous than the grains of sand upon the shores. Too many, too many though. I am, oh, too many though, I am the guardian. Uh, my name is Hamilton. Yes, I understand this. <laughs> like, even he's fed up. To proceed, you must know the words of power. If you are to fail, I will be forced to destroy you. I've come to find Michael. I can't fail, I'm predestined. The angel, I understand this. Are you ready then to tell me the words of power? No, but I'll give it a shot. Tell me the words of power or you may find your way. These are the numbers that uh, Albert scratched on that tree. Oh, he's gonna jump me. Do you know what the, this word means? It's not... It's not a word, it's numbers. You have much to learn. The angel will guide you. Oh, okay, well... <clears throat> I got it right. Yeah, let's go to the shrine. Oh. He's the angel? Where's there? Oh, okay. Right. I guess I'll talk to Albert's punk ass first. Nigga, you let me in here to the fucking devil? I must talk to the angel. You made it. I just knew you would come. Wait a minute, 4151? Oh, fuck, I forgot what the numbers were. How did you know I would be here? That's impossible. You couldn't have known. Okay, how did you know I'd be here? Michael, of course. I told you that he knows everything. I'm so glad you made it. Have you spoken to Michael? Uh, he frightened me, but I'm not sure if I should. You have no reason to be afraid. Talk to Michael. Trust me. Yeah, I got no fucking reason to be afraid. What about you, lady? Little one. Hello, I am Hamilton. The girl is silent. But is she? I feel like I can hear your voice in my head. Grace is silent. Feel her in your mind. Do I? I feel this er feels so strange. I'm avoiding the ones because it makes it sound like, I know he's supposed to be like, it's a child of a serial killer. He's trying to stop him from in the future being a serial killer or something like that. That's what the Steam page said. So I'm trying to avoid the shit that makes, that sounds really fucked up. A soothing thought passed through your mind. Oh, okay. How did you do that? You can almost feel her smile. Will you be my friend? Grace nods her head slowly. Okay. Well, I feel like she's helpful. What up, dude? I see that you've come to me. I don't know about, uh, come to me. Per se, I, I, I don't even know what the fuck I'm doing here. Are you the one called Michael? It is as you have said. Why am I here? I have seen your suffering. Okay. Mm. Ugh. I have tested and tasted your pain. Gross. <clears throat> and behind the eyes of my compassion, I have now called you by name. My name is Hamilton. Truly, it is the name disposed upon you by those who gave you life. But do you not know? Yours is a name that will be remembered for an age. A legacy of blood and tears that could drown an ocean. But Hamilton, this is not the name that will crush their hearts and minds. But perhaps I am getting ahead of myself. Please don't stop, what are you talking about? I will be remembered forever? Yes. 
Long after the jolting pains of death have left you lifeless. When your bones have turned to ash in my mouth. Okay. Your name will be feared and worshipped. Hated and spit upon. Hated and revealed. Tell me- What? Feared and worshipped. What do you mean? Child. You push too hard against the stones. It is not your time yet your time. But the one who can prove their worth to me, he shall know all. Angel, what must I do? It's obviously not a fucking angel, bro. Prove myself how. I see the tears and scars of your addictions. A lot of the feelings lying buried within your breast. Your heart black with the hate and bitterness. And yet from the depths of your depression and the tears which you shed there grows a swelling plague the throes of righteous anger the shrieking voices tearing at your heart <sighs> please how do I stop these voices I have a message for you your father what kind of message the message must come from you and only you can know the words you don't know my father, he will kill me. Is this such a terrible fate? To go swallowed in the warm embrace of pain? I don't. Listen, Mr. Crowley, I don't like what you're going on about, okay? Mm, where do I find this message? This I cannot help you with. Okay, well, I'm gonna go home and play video games. But you will find it. And when it is yours, you will know what to say. I will find the message. I will deliver it. I don't think I can do this. And yet you shall. You forget I've already seen the end of your story. It will be done. Okay, I must go now. Before you go, speak to the one called Grace. She has a gift for you. It will protect you. I have seen it. Hello, Grace. You feel Grace smile. Michael said you have something for me. Grace nods. She holds out her hand. Three needles lay gently in her palm. Thank you. Are these magic? Grace nods. What do these needles do? You feel Grace moving deeply into your mind. You begin to understand. So whenever I'm in trouble, I can use these. Grace nods. You're so perfect. I adore you. What? Thank you for these. Grace nods. You feel her slowly leave your mind. Magic needles. The sharpened tip pricks your finger. Finger you smile. Okay. All right. Um. I'm hitting the R button. Find release. Okay, so the boy seems to like pain. I'm guessing that's why he causes trouble. I don't know what all this other shit's about. Got anything to say? Have you spoken to Grace yet? Why do you care so much about what I do? I don't feel like I... Yeah. I am your friend. Is that so hard to imagine? I'm just not used to that idea. Yes, it is. I don't have friends. I am... I'm your friend. We're connected, you and I. Connected. What do you mean? We have a bond, you and I. Connected. By blood. And spirit. You know it too. I'd rather not talk about this anymore. What do you want to talk about, though? I'd rather just be alone right now. But I feel like I know you. Because you do know me. You just haven't realized it yet. I think this is him. Let Michael show you the way. He will light your pain path and all will be revealed. When you've proven yourself worthy. <clears throat> right, okay. Can we trust these friends? Alright, we're starting to get a real big cast of characters. I think the only person I trust is the voice in my head currently. Uh, you doubt the angel? Could you not see his power? Jesus, all of these are terrible! Um... I never said I doubted the angel. 
doubt and trust are not one and the same. I guess that's true. But your sanity is slipping. Can you feel it? Take your pills, Hamilton, before they come. Before they come? I don't, uh... I don't like that implication. Hamilton, I think we're being followed. Oh, I'm sure- Oh, my pills are gone! Oh no, I'm gonna get jump scared. Ah, oh, shit, it's a fucking thing. Oh, Did I not take the... Oh, it's another one, the needles. Okay, use them. Now. Alright. I don't know what that... That jump scare didn't scare me nearly as fucking much as the last one did. That shit scared the fuck out of me. What the, the first one. I guess I wasn't expecting it. I saw that thing and was like bracing for impact. Wait a moment. Yes, I believe he is coming back to us. Albert. Mm. Hamilton. <laughs> yes, it's Albert. Oh, I got, I got multiple personalities that... Uh, yes. Ah, oh, there you are. <clears throat> I thought we lost you for a moment. Tell me, where did you go just then? I went back. Back? Back to what? The beginning. I see. Do you like it there? At the beginning? Hell no! We were talking about someone when you were asleep. Tell me of this angel. What was his name again? Michael? I guess that's his name. What do you think of this angel? He seemed powerful. He frightened me. I wanted to be just like him. Oh, gross. He frightened me. Fear. It's a crippling thing to be afraid, isn't it? No control, no power, simply fear. Are you afraid, Hamilton? Uh, not here. I like here. Here's nice. I guess sometimes. It's natural to have feelings like this. He's certainly not alone. But tell me, did you obey the angel because you feared him? Or because he told you that you had no choice? Uh, I guess the no choice part. Hamilton, are you alright? What are these creatures? The wolf? Do you not know him? I think you do. Why would I know what that was? Oh, Hamilton. You're smarter than that. <coughs> right, okay, cool. Yeah, got it. I don't know any of this shit, man. Okay, back towards the shed. Ah, yes. I guess I'm heading back home. I don't exactly know where I'm supposed to go. But... <clears throat> so I'm supposed to... Oh, there's the mom. Alright. <coughs> Hamilton! My sweet, sweet boy. Why must you do this to me? Why must you torture me like this? I call for you again and again, but you refuse to come. Mother, I met an angel. What did you just say? Did you say an angel? Yes, yes. She told me that there would be an an- She told me that there would be an angel? An angel who would seek to destroy us all. Now he is a good- uh, His message is not for you. Yes. I can see he has already poisoned your mind. It, must, it is just as she said it would be. The whore. Get out of my head. Hamilton, if your father doesn't kill you, she will. You stupid boy. <coughs> Please, you must help me. Why? <coughs> Why would I help you? Uh, okay. Oh yeah, I was supposed to go to the father and give him the message, but I don't know what the message is. 
And I said I would know it at the time. God, these fucking statues, my dudes. I remember, 44, 45, what does this word mean? Um, maybe... No. No, I, I don't know. No clue. I'm gonna have to pee soon. Hmm. Might have to end this, this playthrough. I got one more... One more beer. Well, actually, you know what? I could I could end it at a two beer, cause I gotta pee. So um, I'll just uh, I'll just pause it right here. Um, yeah. So uh, thanks for watching. I haven't done one of these in like half a year, so I forgot what my outro is. I don't think I have an outro. Thanks for watching. Have a good one.